I actually second. wish I could do this whole video in the like chip monkey kind of looking Snapchat filter just because I think that that's a really really good filter it's better than the puppy dog it's better than the flowers but unfortunately I can't so I'll just throw in a couple of snippets of me in that filter. hello it's Ashley happy new year well it's the second now because I'm filming this at like half two in the morning but happy new year um, new year, new me. Um, I'm new to YouTube, so this is my first ever video. I thought I'd do like a little introductory video to who I am. Um, since 2017, I thought I'd give you 17 facts about me. Fact number one. Okay. I'm going to have to write these down. Okay. So, fact number one is that I... Recently, took my... Oh, I don't know. So, okay, so fact number one is I am a cheeseaholic. I love cheese on everything. Just extra, extra, extra cheese. You see, when you go to a restaurant and they grate some cheese and they finish and I'm looking at them like, you're not done yet. I'm not done. I'm not done. Or when they're like, ah, oh, say when. I'm literally still like, no, keep going. Keep going and going and going and going. Fact number two is my lucky number is seven. It's been seven since I was forever um just because i think it well it's probably just because i was born in the seventh and then i like in my head it's just been the seventh. another fact when i was seven years old i had seven teeth removed um lots of sugar lots of sweets blame my mum sorry mum but yeah i had seven teeth removed and i had to go to the hospital and they had to like i don't yeah i just remember it very very vaguely i just know that i got taken into the hospital i was put under like the thing and they were like okay we're gonna put this on your nose count to ten and then you're like oh. the fact you number th four four is that i absolutely love roller coasters i'm not actually a big fan of heights at all like make me climb up somewhere really high i'll do it but i will be shaking and trembling the whole entire time but roller coasters i love them even though i will be the loudest person screaming on the ride i still absolutely love them um i don't know i just love roller coasters uh, i think it's a thrill it's a thrill numero cinco uh <laughs> Um, when I was younger, so in primary school, I used to really, really want to sprain my ankle. I know that sounds absolutely crazy, but it's because I wanted crutches. And I remember when people used to sprain their ankles and they come to school in crutches, I used to want, I used to want to go. And so I really wanted to Anyone my ankle. who knows me or has seen my blog would know that I love Italy. That is my favourite country. It's the country that when things feel a bit cray cray, um, I end up in Italy and it makes everything better. So Italy is, oh... I, like literally I think of it as home Rome I am in love with Rome like I was there in November 2016 for a, like nine days by myself and it was literally like the best nine days like okay I was in Rome for seven days I was in Italy for nine days but yeah Rome Italy beautiful country beautiful like great people great food and like I feel like everything's with love in Italy like I literally just everything's with love and everyone you know ciao bella ciao bella um, so fact number six, six, is that I used to have a turtle. Very, very, like, vaguely remember we used to have a turtle. But apparently, my mum said to me when I said this to her the other day, she was like, it was her friends and they were going through some sort of breakup and the partner, like, they were deciding who keeps the pet and so we were giving it for a while while they kind of decided amongst themselves who's keeping the baby. Turtle tortoise it was the small fact ones. number seven lucky number seven is that i do not like strawberry dairy products i don't at all well okay well i don't like strawberry ice cream i don't like strawberry milkshake i don't like strawberry yogurt the only strawberry yogurts i will have is munch bunch and fruits those are the only and pity filu other than that i will not have any strawberry dairy products and that's because when i was how old was i i don't know maybe like five or six i had strawberry nesquik and I don't know what happened. I know, I remember climbing up in the cupboard, getting some, and then literally within like 0.5 seconds, I had thrown it up all over the kitchen. And so ever since that day, just the smell. Uh, yeah, no, not a fan. Not a fan. Fact number eight. I really, 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 really want to write a book. It's on my list of things to do before I'm 25, which is in a couple of years. Not that many years, but a couple. But um, I want to write a book. I've started actually writing a book. And the book is, it's fiction and non-fiction. So it's based on my life and some of my experiences. 
and some of the people I've met, but it's, I've added the bit of fiction just because, because it ties in with the story. Fact number nine is I love cheer for the love of cheer. Okay, I love cheer. I've been doing cheer for quite a few years now. Um, I started when I was 10. I've had gaps in between it, but I just love it. It's literally just something that kind of takes me away from everything. Because also, the cheer teams I've been on, I've not been like at the same school as everyone. Obviously, the uni team I'm on, we're all the same uni, but I'm not on the same course. So it's literally just kind of like a complete break away from everything that is like work and academics and that kind of thing i absolutely love cheer and also i just find it so much fun like i just i just love it i just i just look for the love of cheer i can't i can't even tell you I another interesting it. fact is i am five foot two and a half i never used to think basically in primary school i was really really tall and so i literally have just had it in my head that i am taller than I am and it's only when I think it was it was actually quite recently reality kicked and I thought you know what you're actually not as tall as you think you are you just were always the tall girl in the photos in primary school standing on the bench with all the tall boys because I was just a tall girl I think there was only like two of us girls that always were on the back of the bench because we were just so tall um but now I am um, I wouldn't say I'm short some people would call me short I would just say that I'm not exactly average height because I feel like I'm stuck in between being short and being average so I'm just special so I've said before that Italy is my favorite country in yeah, one of my other facts um, but just in general one of the facts about me is I just love to travel um, I love to be just going play even if it's not even outside of the country or even outside London just traveling to different parts of London um, different parts of the UK more so, like I do love to like I to go to other countries if I could do it forever and just be traveling all the time um, I would because I just love traveling I love being on the airplane the only thing I don't like is you see when you go I think it's like the altitude or something like that and your ears start to pop I remember I woke up um, it was I think it was just before we were, I was landing in Italy when I went in November my ears were so pain like I literally woke up almost in tears because I just woke up to excruciating pain and then I was literally oh yeah but then I love that whole feeling when you're popping your ears and it's like it's like when you get a bruise and you're pressing a bruise and it hurts but it's a nice kind of hurt if there's anyone else that feels that way <laughs> Or another fact about me is I used to be painfully shy like believe a lot of people would not believe it a lot of people would not believe that I was a shy person but I generally generally used to be like even as like a teenager sometimes I just be painfully shy um but I'm just really good at kind of like um yeah like covering it up and just smiling through everything but then you can anyone who knows me knows me will be able to tell Ashley is feeling a little bit shy but then I don't really get shy anymore um I think I've just kind of grown up and I'm like I don't really care like why i like meeting people so just go put yourself out there and if they don't like you then love yourself as jb said another fact about me is i used to want to be a rapper it was when i was about 14 and i heard fire alive by chipmunk who now goes by chip and after hearing that i just literally that's it i wanted to be you know the grand team savior back now just a bit more paper <laughs> Um, no, I seriously did want to be a rapper when I was 14. I do have a track which is somewhere, I don't know, it's actually recorded. It was with other people, like, we went to, like, we, I don't know, we worked some music group. It was, like, a, um, it was run by, like, the local borough. But I actually, like, yeah, maybe one day I will spit. <gasps> I'm going to make a music video for you all, and you'll all see me. Stay tuned. Watch this space. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another thing is I'm a Disney princess. I should actually wear my mini ears. Yeah, they actually stay pinned on my wall. So you may be thinking, why isn't she using two hands? But it's because I'm using a selfie stick to film, so... This will have to do. Oh, the... Oh, I don't think my hair is as cute as it was. Oh, there we go, that's why. Oh. Okay. So, yeah. I am a Disney princess. I love Disney. All things Disney. Um... My favourite, some of my favourite movies, Lion King 1 and 2 will always be my favourite. Like, nothing can be um, those two in terms of Disney movies. Like, Lion King 1 and 2 are, like, up there with my favourite movies, but love a good Disney film. Minnie Mouse is my girl. She is my home skillet biscuit. I love Minnie. Um, I have two Minnie Mouses, like, big ones. Um, they're not here with me. They're at my mum's because I'm staying at uni right now. But I will make sure to get them into some video. I actually just need to bring them up here. But, yes, I love Disney. So I decided to keep my mini ears on because I think they're cute. 
Um, another fact about me is I speak backslang. Um, some people will know what backslang is, not many people, well I haven't really come across many people that do, although people will like remember they knew people. I met one girl, um, her name's Sana, shout out to Sana, she's going to be in one of my videos in the future, um, or a couple to be fair, uh, she speaks backslang. We will probably speak backslang together, but if you don't know what backslang is, it's just like a form of, like it's a kind of way of speaking English, not quite, but in English, but doing something breaking, yeah. But I'll say, my name is Ashley and I am, no, I will say something, and if you understand, um, then comment below. Um, another fa um, fact about me is I have wanted to do like TV presenting, radio presenting, um, uh, most most more so like TV presenting for a, a while now. Since I started doing like presentations, motivational speeches, that's one thing I wanted to do. The one thing I do know I need to work on is my pace. I need to learn how to speak slower and that's why I also thought going onto YouTube would be a good start for me because it could help me and teach me um, if I listen back to myself and see the speed that I'm speaking at. So yeah, um, but I thought also I might start like hosting my own videos um, on YouTube, chats with Miss Mayo, watch this space. So I'm currently filming facts but I don't actually know if I've gotten to 17, I'll only actually know when I start editing. So. Here goes. Um, another fact about me is pink is my favourite colour. It was my favourite colour growing up and then when I got to about year one, year two, so like seven, six, seven years old, um, red became my favourite colour and it was red right up until, I'd say until I was about 20, red was my favourite colour. And then I kind of fell in love with Minnie Mouse again and again and again. And I got a pink Minnie Mouse one Valentine's Day and then that's it. I loved Minnie and pink. And pink is mini, even though mini is red. But the mini mouse I got was pink, and that reminded me how pretty pink is. And that's why my favourite colour is pink. I do still have love for red though. I haven't just, you know, I am committed. <laughs> Another fact about me is this sounds really silly, but there was a girl in the sixth form that I went to who had a piercing gun. She bought it off eBay, and I let her pierce my ear, my third ear hole, which no longer exists because. It was literally just in the class, well it wasn't in the classroom, it was like where we all went for our free periods, that classroom. Um, I let her pierce my ear. It's, it lasted a while but it just, um, I think it got infected. But then I think that makes sense because it was not the most sanitary practice. But it was nice while it lasted. Okay, so my last fact is I love, if you've got Snapchat, it's the filter that has, um, it looks like a, I don't know, like some sort of, raccoon slash kind of cuddly teddy berry kind of thing filter i think it's the cutest filter ever i absolutely love it so i will plug in some of those after this video um because i just love it so yeah here is me in using the filter thank you for watching if you liked it give it a thumbs up um I feel like that was so cheesy. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Um, but if you do like it, give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel. Until next time, America. Um, okay, toodles.